Hey everyone, Chris Denham here with Western Hunter. I uh, want to show you today the brand new binocular from Swarovski, the NL Pure. Now this is the first truly new binocular from Swarovski since the EL was introduced back in 1999. Uh, there's been a lot of different renditions of the EL and the SLC, but this binocular, the NL Pure, was built literally from the ground up, completely a unique design. The first thing you'll notice is the ergonomics, uh, the, the, all the curvature that's involved here. Uh, when I first saw it, I thought, oh, it's, you know, it's nice, aesthetically pleasing to look at. But when I, hand, when I hold it, you really get to understand why these ergonomics are so important. There's so many different points of contact for your hand. Swarovski literally took a natural position of a hand and built a binocular to fit that natural position of the hand. So you've got good thumb grips. Uh, again, there's lots of different points of contact, so you've got a lot of extra stability. So it's not just aesthetics. It is truly helps you, uh, especially hand holding, hold it just a little bit steadier, a little bit longer, and a little bit more comfortably. Uh, next thing you'll see is obviously different is this headrest. Uh, when I first saw it, to be completely honest, I thought, no, that's not going to work for me. What's That's going to just get broken. I just didn't see much use in it uh, until I actually got to playing with it and by taking it off and putting it back on, just the extra point of contact that you get on your forehead absolutely stabilizes, I'll throw a number out, 20%, 25, maybe 30% more stable while hand holding with that headrest. What I'm really excited about is like during archery elk season, when I've got a bow in my left hand, it's thick timber, things are happening fast, to be able to pull this up when I'm using it with one hand, because I got my bow in my left hand and have that extra point of contact that it is quite a bit more stable. Um, so it's not just, uh, it's not just there for aesthetics, it comes off and on really easily. This pops right back off and on. So if you don't want it on, you can take it off. It's actually an accessory that's sold separately. Uh, but if you don't, if you think it's crazy, you might want to try it because it's, it does really, it really does help. Um, as far as the optics, uh, when you look through it, the first thing you're going to notice, and probably the most important feature to Western hunters, is the incredible field of view. Uh, it's for the 10 power, it's right at 400 feet, which is about 20, 25% more than an EL 1042. Now, field of view is one of those things that sometimes it can be exaggerated, except for Western hunters because we put our binoculars on a tripod so often. When you put a binocular on a tripod, you really can't experience the entire field of view. This field of view is so wide on these, when I first went to use it, I was looking at the edge to edge clarity and I, and I literally found myself having to like cock my head to, to actually see the edge. It was crazy. And then you get to your like trying to look through a car window sideways. Uh, just you, your brain can't even wrap itself around how big this field of view is. But again, when you put it on a tripod, now everything you can naturally use that entire field of view. And I've, I know I've said this before, but uh, it, it bears saying again, you're, when you're glassing, when you're looking, you're generally going to use the very middle part of the field of view, except when you're on a tripod. You still only have 1% of dynamic acuity of super sharp razor, razor sharp, and it's only about 1%. But again, with it on a tripod, you can be looking around and with that extra field of view, you allow your eyes to do what they most uh, naturally do well in that peripheral vision, which is pick up motion. So literally a bigger field of view, it literally translates into finding more game. Uh, when you're using a tripod. So you'll, the first thing you'll notice is it's huge, but uh, when you get it on the, on the tripod, then you understand just how beautiful that field of view is and how razor sharp it is edge to edge. Again, the NL Pure, um, it's, it's being introduced now. Uh, it'll be available for shipment right around September 1st. You wanna get your order in as soon as possible because there are gonna be an allocated item. It's gonna be tough to get. The Outdoorsman's is already working on tripod adapters. You can always use the bino hand or any of the other wraparound style uh, binocular adapters, but we're working on a, a little cleaner, lighter weight uh, binocular adapter. Again, should be available by the time the binocular is available, but get your order in as soon as you can.